a real quick PowerPoint <coughs> just to show the overall impact of the budget and then I'll quickly break down the police and the fire budget since you're, you're going to be reviewing those tonight. So as you can see, the budget that's in front of you tonight is for $28,175,614. That's an increase of $1,333,302 over the 2018 default. It turns out to be 4.9%. Here I kind of just broke down to show what makes up the budget. So I'm not going to read all of these to you, but it was in that memo that I had provided to you guys also. Um, but it shows that wages are $12.2 million of the budget, or 43.58%. And it breaks down insurance, utilities, debt, retirement, contracts, other benefits, and gas and diesel. So it kind of gives you an idea of what makes up that $28 million budget there. And then it just shows you the graph with the dollars and the percentages. And then here, if you look at the 4.97% increase, it's showing that wages make up 448,380 or 1.67% of that increase is from wages. Contracts account for 352,516 or 1.31%. Other items outside of the utilities and debt and all that is $172,494. Utilities account for 99853 Debt accounts for 90914 Insurance, which would be your workers' comp, your property liability, and, and your health insurance fall into that category, $71,296. Retirement, that's all NHRS, uh, accounts 33338 Gasoline and diesel account for 31945 in benefits such as um, Social Security, Medicare, things like that. It's $32,566. And just gives you a little pie graph yep. there to make it fun. That was good. And this is just showing, um, I was asked by Fred to show appropriations approved by voters in March. So it's basically showing you here that 520,910 or 39% of the 1.3 million is things that were passed and voted on by the voters when they went to the polls um, in uh, March specifically, such as union contracts, uh, the contract for the trash trucks, the trash truck lease and items like that. So we just thought that was an interesting fact for you. And then last, the impact on the tax rate um, for a 1.3 million increase, you're looking at 0.37 cents uh, or $150.92 for the average family home, which is 400 is valued currently at $407,900. And then here I just basically broke down the police department for you. His, the budget that will be before you tonight is $4,370,000. $97,555 increase or 2.28% 2 higher than his default from last year. The wages make up 3,693,312 or 84.5% of the police budget. Mm -hmm. Gas and diesel make up 67,148 or 1.54%. Utilities make up $118,140 or 2.7%. And other items make up $492,318, 11.26%. Then we just have some pretty graphs for you on that. And then I've also broke down the 2.28% is broken down. You can see 1.56% of it is related to wages. And the next highest is 0.7 um, for his other items. And then we have the fire department. Their budget tonight is $3,865,000 or $302. It's an increase of $210,847, or 5.77% from over last year. Wages make up $3,346,614, or 86.58% of the fire budget. Gas and diesel make up $18,014, or 0.47%. Utilities make up $96,282, 2.49%. And other items make up 404393 or 10.46 percent. Good. And there's his graphs there. And his uh, wages there are 4.72 percent of his budget. 
So that's just kind of a quick little rundown for you guys for tonight. And I'll plan to do the same thing um, for the police and fire. I mean, for the public works department when, and maybe recreation when they're here. Thank okay. You. Yep. Thank you.